Okay, this is Danny at Deep South Homestead. We're going to do an experiment here. This is some Fritos out of a bag that we got here at the house. I've always been told that in a case of an emergency, and you didn't have a way to light a fire, you could use Fritos. We're fixing to do this test and just see if it's accurate. There we are. I've always heard if you're gonna in a major bind and you need to start a fire, you can use Fritos. The key is gonna be how long will these few, free, these few Fritos burn without going out? We're gonna we're gonna see here. It's been going 30 seconds, and I'm gonna time it to see just how long them few little Fritos will burn. That right there ought to tell you what we put in our stomach when we eat. Been going two minutes so far. Okay, we've been three minutes so far from them three Fritos. It was in that little wad. I don't know if you can see it right here. The oil has drained out of those Fritos and has run down on the grating in this wood heater here. That's how much oil is in those three Fritos that were stuck together there. So it is true. If you get in a bind and you got a bag of Fritos and you got a match, you can start a fire. Just out of curiosity, we picked this thing up and turned it around. We're going to see if, the, if it'll relight with what little bit's left on it. Fritos take two. There you have it. The other side of those Fritos has lit back up. So not only have we gone three minutes, it's actually going to make it a full four minutes of burning time or maybe longer. Now that's three Fritos stuck together and they are still burning. Okay, I flipped it over while it was burning and it is still going. It has been a full five minutes burning on three Fritos that are stuck together. And it is still going. This just amazes me. Okay, it has now been six minutes and it is finally beginning to dwindle down and just about to go out. So, the verdict is in. Six minutes, three Fritos. You could start a fire with that if you had a match.